Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we're going to look at a new app that is available in Windows 8.1 it's the new core app for food so when you update your Windows 8 machine to Windows 8.1 you have a new food and wine app that is on your uh, start menu or start screen it's one of the new core apps that is now available with Windows 8.1 um, I did a review last time of the um, health and fitness app so um, you have this new app it should be probably on the right side of the screen one of the last apps that you've seen you can click on it and there you will have that new little uh, spoon and fork icon and you'll have the app for different recipes of all sorts and wines it's really nice you can click uh, sorry here it's in French as my computers in French and installed the French version um, so this app is really nice lots of articles comments uh, lots of recipes that you can actually check and go through it's a very 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 nice app What's really nice also about the app is that it talks about wines also, not just food. That's also cool if you're looking for wines, you don't know what to choose. Um, you know, a lot of us go to the liquor store, look at wine bottles and just basically don't know what to choose. Look at bottles, it's very, very annoying because you can look at really nice bottles that are absolutely horrible like you can have something that you know looks quite simple but is a great wine so you can't really you know just by descriptions and um, looks know what a good wine is so here you have the different wines you can have wines from your home country for example here I have Canadian wines available on the left side um, if you're in the United States you probably have US wines so um, depending on the country where you are they'll have suggestions for your local wines and of course all different wines different uh, areas even champagne and uh, you even have a uh, wine without alcohol list so if you're looking for something for maybe someone that doesn't drink alcohol or if you don't drink alcohol yourself uh, in the same app you also have a section for cocktails making your own cocktails that's also really cool when you have a party, you know, Christmas coming up or a birthday party or any types of party at home. It's really cool for that. Uh, of course, there's a little search on the upper right side of the screen. You are searching for something. All you have to do is type it in. So, for example, I want to make um, chicken cacciatore. Let's put it in French, poulet, cacciatore, because mine is in French, so you would usually put chicken cacciatore, and there you'll have some recipe come up with a very nice picture, it's very illustrated, so it's really nice. And one of the cool options about this wine and food app is that you have at the bottom a little icon with an and on it. And what's cool with it is that this little icon uses your tablet to know when you are cooking. When you are cooking, you don't want to touch your tablet or your computer. You might have your hands full of grease or flour of all sorts of food because we're preparing food. What's cool here is that you're going to have that recipe on the screen and with the webcam all you have to do is pass your hand in front of the screen without ever touching your laptop or tablet and it changes the page as you see here it changes the page of the recipe no touching of your app, your computer anymore just swipe in front of the camera and it changes the page so you can actually do your recipe without at all touching your computer so it doesn't get full of flour 
I have a lot of experience with that. I enjoy cooking. And that's the biggest problem. <laughs> it's that it actually always the same thing. You're using your uh, device and at one point you have to move the screen so you can see the recipe and stuff like that. Uh, what you can also do is add your recipes to a planning, a recipe planning on the bottom uh, left also. You can add these recipes. If you do one and you really love it, you can add it to your own collection so that you're, you can actually easily go back to the um, recipe when you need to, uh, when you want to do it again. There's a print option on the bottom right and you can also pin a single recipe on the start screen. So if you have a few favorites, you can actually just pin them directly to the start menu on your uh, and you start screen on your computer which is pretty nice also so uh, this is a great app either for food wine you can make your own little um, click on your recipe and you can actually uh, click on a list make a list of uh, all the food you need that when you go to the grocery store all the groceries you'll need uh, you have the latest um, searches that you've done always available you have the um, food of the day or the um, menu of the day that you can click on and add different menus so if you search for example you pass an hour or two you're looking at recipes and you're thinking wow these are cool recipes I want to make this week well you can plan your week and say okay uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday these is, this is what I want to do these are the recipes I want to have so um, you can plan your whole week with this and it's pretty cool so uh, great, great app. Uh, you can search for all sorts of foods. You can go through the different options that's uh, already available here and check if you can uh, find something that you might want to do actually uh, to eat at home. Really nice, great app. I think this is a cool option. It's available only on Windows 8.1 machines, so if you don't have 8.1 yet, the only way to have this new uh, wine and food app is to actually um, upgrade to Windows 8.1, and there's going to be on your start screen. If you don't find it on your start screen by any chance, then just go into the uh, little arrow on the bottom left and look at all the apps on your screen. You should find the uh, food and wine app uh, there on one of the apps that you have on your uh, your computer. So you just go through and try to find it in here, and you'll finally have the uh, the app itself. Um, you can also search for it in the uh, app search, so uh, that you'll actually uh, find it up. Here we go. I just put wine in French to get it up. So you just put the wine or, uh, you know, food and it's going to pop up. So uh, this is a great app. Go and check it out. I think it's a great add-on to Windows 8.1 and uh, might want to uh, make you cook more at home. Who knows? Thanks for watching the video, hope you enjoy and um, if you do enjoy our channel, please subscribe and you'll be informed when new videos are online. You can also um, give us thumbs up if you like the videos we make. We try to do uh, videos every week and we try to help you and help you learn more about Windows 8 and 8.1 and how to use it. Maybe you have a feature of Windows 8 you'd like us to make a video of or an app, let us know, we'll try to put that video online and hopefully you will come back to the official Windows 8 channel and especially if you have that new Windows 8 machine or planning to buy one it's a great channel to learn more um, so thanks for watching and uh, hope to see you again on the official Windows 8